Well, hello again, everyone. Welcome back. Me and Ashley are here to try another XMRE chili with beans. Ooh, my favorite. Yeah, you love beans, right? Oh, so much. You're such a bean eater. Yeah, they're good for your heart. Yeah, are they? <laughs> okay. So this is their uh, 1300 XT whatever. <laughs> so it's 1300 calories on average. Um, but XMRE is, I don't know, I've always liked them. I mean, they tend to come at relatively close to USMRE stuff. And some of the things you'll see in here are components to USMREs. And then they have their own stuff that uh, they'll also put out to, into the universe. So let's see what we got. Soy nuts. Okay. Wow. Did you want to pick some? Fig bars. You're not in frame. In there, frame. you're sort fig. of in frame. Kind of. Kind of. Fig bars? Yeah, fig bars. <laughs> Lemonade packet, which is probably, yeah, it actually feels okay. Oatmeal chunk cookies. Are they both cookies? Oh, I think so. I don't know. Nope. No. Snack bread. Cookie. You know, maybe they don't do it anymore. They used to do round crackers, pilot bread crackers. Okay. I wish they would put those back in here, but they don't. But yeah, so oatmeal chocolate chunk cookie, actually one of my favorite things. Oh, yeah? At MREs, okay. yeah. And then here is our chili with beans in its package. And that's it. Cool. Man, no cheese spread. Mm. That's too bad. Okay. Decent enough spread, though. Can't be mad at it. Um... Flameless ration heater. I love these. The XMRE heaters, I think, are really, really nice. As I struggle with it. One, they have nice, big pouches that have a little foldable bottom so you can stand them upright. And you don't have to fight with it so much. Like you do with the USMRE, which is much smaller, and I've torn those stupid bags more than I should have. We have our pad for, uh, you know, the, this is the actual heating component. And we'll shove that down in the bottom of the bag. The only thing that, you know, I don't know if it turns people off. It does require, well, require is a strong word, but does say it requires... A lot more water than a USMRE. So you're filling to this fill line. That's quite a bit. Mm -hmm. And it does take the heater a moment to get engaged. So usually like a minute and it might start up. So I'm just going to pause, come back as it starts going, and then we'll throw our chili in there. All right. So if you can hear that sound, it means it's finally ready. It took about what? Ah. Minute? Yeah. Minute and a half? A minute and a half. All right, so we just toss our chili in there. Does have its little vent hole on the top, uh, and gets nice and hot. It really gets going when it gets going, huh? It's funny because it gets going and then it just sort of dies whoop. down. Yeah, just chills. Yeah, it is what it is. Anyway, so we're gonna let that set, uh, get warm, and then we'll come back and try it. Heater really killed it. Yeah, sure it was. Did. A, it was still bubbling away and we've kind of we, we kind of shoot videos in bulk yeah so it's just been steadily going on its own and this thing is high it's hot <laughs> yeah you gotta love you gotta love these heaters so okay let's get our chili out i didn't use my teeth on that mm -mm. no you sure didn't to get it like a quarter of the way there we go mm -hmm. Oh, beans. Where's the weenies? <laughs> so, there is a Canadian IMP uh, that is just beans and weenies. Yeah. Well, beans and wieners. They, sh they should. I love it. You want to start on those? Okay, I'll yeah, start down do here. That. Good idea. I can do something. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> I guess you could do something. You're pretty cool. <laughs> oh, poor fig bars are somewhat destroyed. Uh, they've seen a little bit of heat. They look okay though. It smells like rosemary. 
Oh, the breadsticks. Did I read that right? What did it say? Was it? No, it says multi-grain snack bread. Th those are the breadsticks, which I actually kind of like those. Yeah. I mean, yeah, they're multi-grain, but I, I thought it was going to be the loaf instead oh, of the stick. That's okay. a, Oh, nice. Oh, That's goodness. cool. So the oatmeal cookies a bit crumble. Yeah, yeah, they always are. They always are. I am a little surprised with the soybean. The little soy nuts. Yeah. You know? Do they last longer than regular peanuts or something? Or just I have like... no idea. I have to imagine they just got a stock of them. Because yeah. it's just so easy to just do peanuts. Yeah. But there again, peanut allergies. Oh, yeah, that's true. I don't know. If Wait, soy but are these soy count. nuts? There's a lot of soy allergies, too. <laughs> well, that's true. I have allergies for everything, folks. Well, and if you listen to anybody, they'll, the soy is going to give you the gynecomastia as a man. Yeah. Make, make women more apt to fight in MMA fights. All right, give me a <laughs> Let's eat this. <laughs> Let's get swole. <laughs> There's just our little lemon powder. Not a lot in there. Okay. Where do you want to start? Um. Honestly, for me, the cookie. <laughs> Fine. Let's start with the cookie. Just watch it. It's crumbly. Good little cookie. Cookie. Nice chocolate dry cookie. Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't know. Out of all the desserts that USMREs do, I still always come back to that damn cookie. Mm -hmm. It is dry, but it's good. It's mm -hmm. got just enough sweetness in it, just enough chocolate. It crumbles all over the place. Yeah. But I, I've always enjoyed yeah, it's, it. It's really not bad. All right, what next? I guess to get it over with beans. God, Jesus. <laughs> I don't like beans. <laughs> it is a lot of beans. Looks like we have a couple different varieties there. Probably pinto and uh, kidney. That's not bad. No. That's fine, yeah. Fairly standard mm. chili. Hit a chili powder. It's weird because it almost has, to me, that metallic taste, mm -hmm. like you would get in a canned chili, but it's in a bag. Yeah. But here's what you really have to do. You have to take your little stick and dip it in the chili. Ooh. And then dip it in the soy nuts. And then dip it in the cookie. And then dip <laughs> it in your mouth? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, we've actually got some beans on it. I was just dipping yeah. it. Nope. All right. All right. Let's go hardcore. Bean sandwich. Hardcore. Bread's pretty good. I like the Very bread. Very soft. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, it's got spices in it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, got flavor. You know, there are aromatics there, <clears throat> which are really nice. And that's why when it said just multi-grain snack bread, I wasn't excited. But as soon as I saw the perforations, because this... I don't know if it was out before it, but I'm pretty sure that this, the first time I saw it was when they dropped the, oh crap, what was it? It was a fettuccine thing. It was like a spinach and something supposed to be like a, like an Alfredo type of deal. Mm -hmm. And nobody liked the pasta because it was basically crap. It was mush. But the breadsticks. Yeah. The breadsticks, the cool little Italian seasoned breadsticks, mm -hmm. that's where it was at. I like these a lot. They're one of my favorites. I just haven't had them in so mm -hmm. damn long. I'm kind of ready to sip on some lemonade here. Got enough dry stuff? Yeah. Go mm -hmm. ahead. <laughs> Thank you. Chicks first, man. Mm. Hydration. So good. Very light. Lemon taste, yeah, just just light. enough there. Mm -hmm. Like a lemon water. Almost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very simple. I probably add more liquid than what it calls for, but mm -hmm. that's how I roll. Let's eat some nuts. 
Yep. They're not bad. Yeah, they're as I remember. Soy nuts. They work. <clears throat> All right. Fig Newton time. You want that little guy? Sure. It's a good piece. Figgy fig. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mmm. Old Fig Newton. <laughs> I like Fig Newtons. I like Fig Newtons too, though, but I like a fresh thing. I will... I would go through a tray of those. Mm -hmm. Like nothing. <laughs> and I will sit there and be happy about it too. All right. So fairly simple meal here, I would say. Carbo load. Mm -hmm. You're getting some fiber from the beans, which is fine. But there's some probably some improvements that I could think of. Here, cheese sauce would be awesome to go with this. Yeah, yeah. But regardless of that, everything was pretty decent. Yeah, I think it's fairly balanced. Some of the meals aren't always balanced. This one's yeah. this one's fairly balanced. I like this. You know, I guess we do this for for the bigger ones. Mm -hmm. So, uh, what was your favorite? Uh, to what was your least favorite? Oh. Favorite to least favorite. I think I'm going to work backwards. Um, my least favorite, I think I would probably just go with the soy nuts just because they're the most basic thing. The Fair. third, or the next one, second to last, would probably be the beans just because I don't like beans, but it was good. Yeah. And, you know. It's not bad. So, cool. Um, third would be the fig. Second would be... Probably go cookie and then first the oh the bread, the bread. first huh? yeah okay yeah I mean I, I'm probably fr from worst yeah I, I'm not really a fan of soy nuts I, it's just not my thing I'm gonna put the fig Newton down at four which mm -hmm. is kind of hard it's just I like fre nice fresh fig Newton you know when you're eating your wasp eggs <laughs> you want to eat the freshest of wasp eggs oh okay. That's what they say in, in the figs. Yeah. You know, they grow wasp wool. Oh, okay. I'm learning things. Yeah. <laughs> For those of you who enjoy Newtons, you're killing the wasp, so go you. Um, the chili is 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 fine. It's it's middle of the road, so it'd be chili. And then I, I might also go cookie and breadsticks, but those are a bit interchangeable because I do love the cookie. But the breadsticks were just... It's so nice to see them again. Mm -hmm. It's like... Yeah, it's just like seeing... Jalapeno cheese spread after you've just had regular cheese spread for far too long. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, lemon drink. Oh, yeah. That was somewhere <laughs> in there, too. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's neutral. It's fine. It's nothing amazing. But anyway, if any of you tried this at home, let us know what your thoughts were. Uh, and as always, leave us suggestions in the comments for future videos. If you have anything you'd like to send in to be reviewed, the P.O. Box is in the description, along with the Patreon link. You don't have to support us on Patreon, but you can if you want. And don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.